school one day, Aladdin opened up the refrigerator looking for a snack. He found some apples and grapes, but he was not in the mood for fruit. He found some chocolate pudding, but he knew he would get in trouble if he ate it without permission. Near the back of the refrigerator, he spotted a jar marked Mr. Giggles brand Magic Pickles. Hmm, how interesting. I don't think I like pickles, but I've never tried a magic pickle. I'm sure this is an acceptable and nutritious snack. I'll be trying something new besides. He opened the jar, jar fished out a pickle, and took a bite. It was very flavorful, kind of, kind of like, like chocolate mixed with popcorn. Suddenly, a strange elf-like creature appeared. It had blue skin and wings, and it hovered in the air. Who are you? I am the pixie of the pickle jar. Every time you, every time you eat a magic pickle, you summon me your wishes, my command. Hmm. But she. See, I wish I was the coolest kid in the world. She, we, she, way, she, why, she, land. I agree, a land wish to be the coolest kid in the world. Poo, pow, just like that, Aladdin found himself in a cave. Across from him sat a boy wearing a very winter coat. Where am I? Who are you? You're at the North Pole. My name is Ed. It's a beautiful day outside today. 28 degrees and snowing. Hey, do you want to go sledding? You can make snow angels or we could have a snowball fight. This is not exactly what I meant that I am the coolest kid in the world. I have to get out of here. I want to go home. Aladdin noticed that he still had his jar of magic pickles, so he took a bite and another one. The pixie appeared shivering. Mama, master, your call, you called, I am the pixie of the pickle jar. Your wish is my command. Sometimes Aladdin had imagined what it would be like to fly. He would just spread out his arms like the wings of a bird. He would pretend he could go up in the air above his house, above his town. I wish. I wish I could fly to wherever I wanted to go. Abracazib, abracablai, I grant Aladdin just to be the Aladdin was to fly. Who found just like that Aladdin found himself sitting in an airplane. Welcome to Jerk and Express Airlines. We're on the direct flight from the North Pole to our hometown. We'll be reaching an altitude today of nearly 175,000 feet. Our travel time will be approximately three weeks, so sit back and enjoy the trip. In a few minutes, attendants will be making their way through the cabin with in-flight beverages service. <laughs> Three weeks? Who ever heard of a three-week flight? This is terrible. This is not what I meant when I said I wanted to fly. Can I get you anything, sir? Can I offer you a glass of fresh pickle juice? Or would you rather have a soft drink? We have puffed up cool diet or root beer. Could I just have a glass of water, please? Would you like a pickle wedge on that? No thanks. Aladdin noticed that he still had his jar of magic pickles. They were too 
two pickles left. I've had enough of this silliness. I wish to be cool. I wind up in an igloo. I wish I could fly and I wind up in an, on an airplane. I'm going to make a wish that the pixie cannot mess up. Aladdin bit one of the magic pickles. Instantly, the pixie appeared in the empty seat beside him. This is a great movie they are showing. Don't you think Stuart Pickle is one of my favorites? Yes, it's just great. Now I have a new wish, and I want you to listen very carefully. Your wish is my command. Okay, then. I wish I had my own toy store. Bibbly Tofu, Bibbly Tofu. I grant a land wish to have his own toy store. Oof. How just like that, Aladdin found himself in the living room of his home. home. For several minutes, nothing happens. Then, then the doorbell rings, rings and Aladdin answered it. Good afternoon. I'm here for UPS, United Pickle Service. I have a package for a Mr. Aladdin. Could you please sign this form? Now please sign this duplicate form. Now please sign this triplicate form. Okay, then here is your package, sir. Have a very nice afternoon. Aladdin's box was very small. He tore it open as fast as he could. Inside he found a tiny model of a grocery store. When he looked very carefully, he went good. Could see tiny items lined up on the shelves, tiny boxes of cereal, tiny cans of soup, tiny jars of pickles. Pickles, pickles, pickles. I asked for my own toy store, and what do I get? A store that is a toy. I get a toy store. Aladdin had one magic pickle left. He took a bite and immediately the pixie appeared. The pixie was sitting in the living room of his favorite chair playing a video game. I made three wishes and not one turned out as I expected. I feel cheated. What do I need to get a good wish? You... You have to word your wish very carefully. Okay, I think I have a good wish. I think I figured out a way to get everything how I want. Are you listening? I'm listening, sir. Are you ready? I'm ready, sir. I wish for three new pickles in this jar. Rickety Roo, Tickly Tuck, I grant a land wish for three new Poof, poof, how just like that, there were three new pickles in the pit. Aladdin fished one out and took a bite. <laughs> These don't taste like chocolate mixed with popcorn. Aladdin took another bite and another, but the pixie did not appear. He ate another pickle, still no pixie. Oh, I get it. The pixie said I had to make my wish very carefully. I wish for three more pickles in the jar, but I forgot to wish for three more magic pickles. Aladdin was not as unhappy as he expected. He was tired of dealing with the pixie, and he was tired of having his wishes turn out in the weird ways. Besides, he found that he kind of liked the taste of pickles. He reached into the jar and pulled out another one.
Hmm, these pickles are not so bad. In fact, they are kind of tasty.